more violence in Central Park. That's right. After multiple knife point robberies last week, two people were randomly attacked within the last 24 hours. Fox News Arthur Chien is live in Central Park with details on these latest incidents. Arthur. Well, Steve, Natasha, of the two incidents, all within the last 24 hours, as you pointed out, here in Central Park, one was with a hammer uh, that a victim was assaulted with, and the other one took place here, where it is a well-known actor who was attacked from behind with a rock. Now, police tell us it was at 7:45 last night that actor Michael Stuhlbarg was hit from behind with a rock uh, in the neck. It was an unprovoked assault, they say, and they say the 55-year-old actor then chased his attacker down as he fled the park running eastbound on 91st Street towards Madison Avenue, where NYPD officers happened to be stationed. Those officers arrested the 27-year-old suspect, who they say has an extensive history of random unprovoked assaults, including attacks on people who were actually trying to help him. Now, a second attack took place hours later on the other side of Central Park, just inside of 64th Street. That was also an unprovoked attack, and in that case, a woman was hit from behind with a hammer. She collapsed, and police say her attacker rode off on what's been described as either a moped or a scooter. The suspect in that case is still on the loose. I run in the park. I take walks in the park. Um, it's very upsetting to hear that this is happening. After 30 years of being here, I still don't like to come to the park at night. Well, both victims, police tell us, are expected to be okay, at least physically. And we know um, from Michael Stuhlbarg's people that he is actually in a Broadway production opening tonight. We have uh, coverage over there. We will see if he has anything to say about that. But here in Central Park, usually uh, considered one of the safer parts of the city, there appears to be a bad trend going on this year with uh, nearly a dozen assaults so far this year compared to two at this point last year. That's the latest from here in Central Park. Arthur Chan, Fox 5 News. Steve, Natasha, back yeah, to you guys. Troubling indeed. All right, thanks. Thanks, Arthur.